Hi guys, welcome back to Trendy Mommy. You ask, we deliver. Here we are with another tie-dye video for you. This time we're gonna show you six cute and fun designs to personalize your crew socks. For this DIY, you're gonna need a big plastic bag, your white crew socks, a pair of disposable gloves, and the tie-dye kit. If you don't have one yet, you can check the description box down below where we listed all the materials for this project. Now let's start, shall we? First things first, open the bottles with the pigment powder and fill the water in. Some of these bottles come with guidelines so you know how much water you need to fill in. My advice is to fill just half of the bottle first and shake it up so the pigment blends perfectly with the water. Then fill the rest. Number one, bullseye heel. For this design, we're gonna need four rubber bands. Take a pair of damp socks and create a tip from the heel section and start adding the rubber bands along the length. Now use the black, brown, and red dye bottles to cover the areas around the rubber bands. We want to create light gray and pink orangey shades. So after wrapping them up in a plastic bag, we let them soak for one hour and rinse under cold water before washing. But if you want to keep the dark shades, you may want to leave the pair of socks soaking for four to eight hours instead. Number two, bullseye and strice. For this design, we're gonna need 10 rubber bands. Take the sock and on the side, create the first bullseye tie. Use a second rubber band an inch from the first one. Then from the toe create a sequence of rubber bands and repeat for the other sock. Now use the ocean blue, yellow, red, and baby blue dye bottles. Once you're done coloring, tie the socks together.
Wrap them up with a plastic bag and let them soak for one hour. And rinse under cold water before washing. Number three, Shibori Rainbow. For this design, we're gonna need four rubber bands. Take one sock and pleat from toe to cuff. Then use two rubber bands to seal. Repeat with the other sock. Now use the baby blue, yellow, purple, and red dye bottles. Once you're done coloring, stack one on top of the other and place in a plastic bag to soak for one hour. Again, rinse under cold water, then wash to set the shades. Number four, sunset stripes. For this design, we're gonna need six rubber bands. Take one sock, fold in half along the heel line and create a tip with the rubber band. Repeat for the other sock. Now add two extra rubber bands on each sock along the leg and foot. And repeat with the other sock. Now use the yellow, orange, and pink slash red dye bottles. Once you're done coloring, place them in a plastic bag to soak for one hour. And again, rinse under cold water before washing to set the shades. Number five, heart. For this design, we're gonna need a pencil and eight rubber bands. Fold the sock to the side, and with the help of a pencil, draw half a heart. Mirror to the other sock. Thank you. 
Now use the half heart line as a guide to fold. Then tie a rubber band along the line to seal the shape. Add a second rubber band to the foot section. Add two more to the leg section. Now use blue, yellow, and red dye bottles. Wrap in a plastic bag. Let them soak for one hour, rinse, and wash. Number six. For this design, we're gonna need five rubber bands. Tie the socks together from toe to cuff. leaving an inch or two from each rubber band to create the stripes. Use brown, red, purple, and grass green dye bottles. Place the socks in a plastic bag. Let them soak for one hour, rinse, and wash. We love how they turned out. What do you think? Leave a comment below and tell us which one is your favorite. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.